Hello, everyone. In this video, we will demonstrate how to run Java programs with MySQL database from Eclipse 2022. Now, first, if you um, need uh, help on basic setup of Eclipse 2022, you can go to this website and look for this developing Java programs using Eclipse 2022. So now I have everything set up already. So I'm going to go Eclipse ID for Java developers 2022. <clears throat> All right, so this is the uh, <clears throat> project, I already have it. So I'm gonna create a simple test program. So this is new Java class. It's simple JDBC. I have this program already. It's the one from my uh, Look, I'm, so I'm going to copy and paste this simple JDBC right here. So now I'm going to run the code from simple JDBC.java. I'm going to choose run as. So here is Java application. So I'm going to run simple JDBC. Now we have a problem here is the, um, the driver is not a font. So we need to add the driver here. So first thing we need to do is to uh, download the driver. Now, if you installed your MySQL database, you um, um, installed the uh, most recent version. So the version you need to check is that's the version. Um, I have it. Um, so you can check in my SQL space dash dash version and see this is the version here. When you install it and you have inst installer and go to the installer and check JDBC driver. It's the uh, JEC connector. I already have it. So you can see it. Um, I did this um, search and search this MySQL dash connector dash Java and look for this 8.0. So because I have this 8.0.30, uh, um, so if you check on this 8.0 and you're going to find it. Okay, so you're gonna find it somewhere. Um, so it's going to take some time. I already have it. It's right here. It is um, uh, my SQL dash connector dash Java dash 8.0.30 Java. So this is the one. So it's coming up right here. So you see, it's it's it, this is the one. So I need to go right here to do this. Um, right click on the uh, project note, choose um, um, build path and now configure build path. So here's the library and go to classes, class path, add external jar file. And now just go to find this, this is where the job file is. Click on this, open, apply, apply and close. So now I have it right here. This is the uh, MySQL JDBC driver. So this is the .jar file. This is the one I have here now. It's, it's right here. 
All right, so I'm gonna go back to run the code now. So run this. Okay, uh, now there's a warning here. Uh, actually, you don't need to load this in your program. It's going to be in the new Java version. It's going to be automatically discovered. So you can rerun the code now, and this is going to be fine. All right. So just to make sure and you get the uh, uh, the driver that matches your MySQL database. All right, that is all for using MySQL in Eclipse. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.